Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Fleece Fox Studio. I just picked up the WL Toys V686G. This is a quadcopter that has FPV and uh, it also records 720p. So I'm looking forward to trying this out. So let's do a quick unboxing and then you can witness my first flight. Let's get to it. Let's get started here. Whoops, upside down. All right, very nice. Got our LiPo in here. Looks like some extra props. Let's see if we can get this guy out of here. All right, there's the controller. And... Okay, see those are just extra props. We'll keep those where they are. Pull this out of here. Okay. So, got the uh, LiPo charger with the adapter for the plugs here in the US. Have a card reader with card. Looks like four gigabytes. Okay. In here, we've got landing gear, prop guards, antenna. Very cool. Let's see what's in here. That's the uh, screen for FPV. We'll be trying that out here. And then that's a uh, charger for that screen. So let's take a look at the quad itself. It was held in here by some twisty ties. It's a lot lighter than I was expecting. Not much bigger than a hand. Uh, so there's your camera. Looks like it is not adjustable. Uh, antenna there. And there are some LED lights on the underside. Got gear motors there. Very cool. So this latch is for the battery. I guess we'll try that out here in a minute. I like that. So uh, the landing gear is already on here. What's in this bag must be the uh, controller uh, attachment for the FPV. Here's the controller. It comes with some foam on the sticks here to protect those. On off there in the middle. Looks like a big battery. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six batteries required. I've got those with me. Very cool. So apparently this little piece here is to uh, attach the screen. And it comes with these two um, thumb screws. So let's see if we can get this attached here. Plop this on here. I hope you can see that. Get this put on up under here. Then use these screws in here. Fairly simple install. I'll tighten that down some more here in just a moment, but. That's the general idea. Okay, so I put the screen on. Here's the antenna. Now I can already see something I don't care much for. And that's how flimsy the, uh, the screen is here. It uh, just could easily fall off when you're flying, so I may have to modify that with some tape or something. So I'll be the first to admit that I am not a skilled flyer. So for my first couple of runs, I'm going to be putting these prop guards on. And it looks like there's these little tiny screws that are going to be put in here. I'm probably going to lose half of them. But uh, there's going to be three to each prop guard. Let's see if I can get these installed. Okay, all of those prop guards are now installed. So, let's get the LiPo here and install it. And I think we'll be ready to do our first test fly. 
So under the, under the camera here, there's a slot for the micro uh, SD card here. Good click in there. All right. So now I'm just going to slide the lipo in, but not connect it just yet. There we go. Okay, let's see if I can fly this thing or not. I'm gonna plug up the battery. Okay. There's some lights on it. Turn this on. We got some movement here. Now I didn't look to see which one of these is camera, so I think this takes a picture. I think this one starts the filming over here. Okay, <laughs> that was actually the roll button. <laughs> Thank goodness for those prop guards. I'll have to look up to see what the uh, filming button is here. Let's turn on the FPV. Okay, we've got signal in here. Set glasses down. I like how steady this thing is. Okay, so I just pushed the uh, top button up here and it started uh, filming in here, so I think we're good to go. This is very fun. I think it gets into some kind of spin and uh, has a difficult time, but not really sure. <laughs> That's incredibly fun.
Well, I have to say, this thing was loads of fun. I definitely would recommend buying one of these. Uh, it's very stable. Um, you really don't have to have any skill, obviously. So you can just pull this out of the box and take it for a spin. I will uh, give you a link in the description for Amazon. You can buy one of these. A little over $100 and well worth it. Thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Fleece Fox Studio, and I'll see you next time. Bye.